is Dr. Ruscio. I'm here with Lizette, who has had an interesting couple of things that we've uncovered. Uh, when she first came in, fatigue was an issue, skin clarity, irregular uh, periods, and feeling of cold oftentimes in the hands. Um, and also, um, the, well, the skin we talked about not, not being great. So one of the things that she had reported was this, this chronic anemia that just kept coming back and coming back and coming back. And her Kaiser doctors would put her on some iron for a little while, things would get regular, and then a little while later, a few months later, everything would come back. Yes, for many years ago, since 2004. Yeah, so it's repeat anemia that wouldn't go away. Yes. So we found the anemia, we've been treating the anemia, but the other thing that we found along with this that I think explains where the anemia comes from is the H. pylori infection in the stomach. And we've been treating the H. pylori along with the anemia, mm -hmm. and you've really kind of, it was like everything came together for you, and yes. I think pretty much all of your symptoms are gone yes. at this point. Feeling great. And one of the dots I wanted to connect was because H. pylori can shut down acid production in the stomach and acid is needed to absorb iron, the reason why there was this inability to absorb iron chronically was likely because of the H. pylori bacteria damaging the stomach's ability to secrete acid and therefore absorb the iron. So what I'm anticipating we'll see is you won't, uh, you won't notice that in a year from now when we repeat some of the blood work the anemia comes right back. But how about things that you know, you've know you noticed, uh, you've noticed a number of things over the last 30 days. Do you wanna share any insights with things that you've noticed in, in your own body and how, how you felt? Yeah, so at the beginning, I felt a little worse because it was part of cleaning everything out. <laughs> and uh, I just felt great. Yeah. Now, feeling really, really good. I just wake up in the morning and can go do my things, can go with my life and just not feeling tired, so it's amazing. <laughs> and your nose was feeling really cold, you were saying, Yes, right? it was my nose, it was my feet and, and my, my hands, extremely cold, even in summertime, and I was always wondering what, what it's wrong, Sure. and they will, on Kaiser, they will give me always the wrong things that never treat me for for what I really have. Sure. And your energy was is mm -hmm. better? Yes, a lot better. And also my skin is it's amazing. I've been dealing with acne, with melasma, with a, a lot of stuff for the last two years. And, and it got a little worse the first week, like, like yes, you were saying, right? Yes, skin, skin also it got, got worse. worse. And, uh, which you see sometimes when things die in the gut and they mm -hmm. kind of come out. I guess it's good to, to know that it gets worse. It's a sign that it's going to... It's a sign you're cleaning some yes. stuff out. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, just feel great now. Good, good. Yes. So we're going to continue to monitor her. Uh, if we see any other interesting stuff, we'll, we'll keep everyone posted. But uh, just an interesting case, it shows you how some simple detective work back to the gut can figure out why for example, in this case, there was a chronic anemia that never really responded. So, Lizette, thank you for talking with us. Thank you. All right. Thank you.